Well, Happy New Year. I'm in Scottsdale, Arizona, where it's about 75 degrees and sunny. It's actually hot when you get in the sun. And I'm traveling today, Monday, January 1st, to Michigan, northern Michigan, at my house in Vanderbilt, Michigan, where it's been below zero in the evenings lately. And recently, a few days ago, it was 18 below zero Fahrenheit. So it's going to be quite a contrast, but I'll, I'll only be there for two weeks. Then I'm coming back to Arizona to do uh, another sequence of gigs. So I had some interesting gigs in December, end of the year 2017 with the Bang, concert at St. Luke's Church with a quartet, including Chris Canellis on sax, Zach Carson on bass, Ron James on drums. And I think I have some video of that posted on my video blog here somewhere. And then uh, I did a series of gigs at Dal and DeLuca that were very interesting. My mentor, Judy Roberts, and her husband, Greg Fishman, a tenor sax player. Judy is a pianist, vocalist from Chicago. And uh, we teamed up together, did a trio with uh, acoustic piano and an electronic keyboard, and then Greg playing saxophone. So that was a very interesting night, Mag one of those magic nights. Um, and we had uh, some friends come out, and, and Lisa Dahl, the owner of the restaurant, was, seemed to be very happy. Then we celebrated the anniversary of her restaurant with Viz Maya singing with the, with the same uh, trio that I had at the church concert. And then last night, New Year's Eve, I had a trio without a drum, without a drummer, with Chris Canellis and um, Zach Carson. So, month of December, yeah. Ended the year with the, uh, on, a, on a high note. Uh, the low note of the year was when I had a series of gigs canceled. In the, and on one day in May, I, got two, I had two phone calls where I had, I think, 50 or 60 gigs canceled in, in uh, one day. I made up for it somewhat during the summer, but I also had some nice time off <laughs> and um, enjoyed the uh, northern Michigan environment and experience, which I've also blogged about in the past. You can check out my video blog on Sandner Music on YouTube where I talk about the northern Michigan experience. Um, so I'm going to try to continue to do the video vlogs this year. I think that's uh, going to be in my New Year's resolutions. Also going to try to do some things I've been thinking about, uh, soul searching, thinking about doing something artistically that's uh, that's going to be more suited to, to what I, I really do, what I, I really, I'm really hope, I think best at, and that's uh, performing live in, in, the, in the style of uh, jazz that I do with the great musicians I'm just privileged to work with. I've just uh, really been blessed by having these great musicians that I've just seemed to hook up with uh, for, for these gigs. So I'm very grateful for that. I'm going to use that as inspiration to do something creative this year. And that, that means probably songwriting and producing a recording. Also, that ties in with the online musician program that I'm doing with uh, Le uh, Leah McHenry. And um, also could take things um, with a, a different attitude this year. I th people are saying 2018 is going to be the best year. I hear a lot of optimism out there. Uh, things are on the upswing. Things are going to be great. Um, so I'm looking forward to seeing great things artistically, financially, and uh, in, in deep in, in the... In the, in the is a soul-searching sense, finding a deep sense of happiness and uh, contentment for myself and for those around me. And, of course, you find happiness and contentment by doing things for other people who are around you. So this is highfalutin stuff. <laughs> so uh, wish us all luck. And uh, wish me luck. I hope that uh, I, I just feel like I'm, there's going to be a circle of people and souls around around me or and I'll be around them that um, we're going to help each other propel each other to greater things 
find that groove, you know, that when you're playing the, a good jazz tune and you get, you get into that groove, you just feel so good. It's sort of like a gospel feeling without words. You know, it just has a, a great elevation of your soul that goes along with it. So that's it. New Year. Happy New Year. Great things in the New Year. One more little story before I um, sign off. I saw something on Facebook that uh, really hit me. It said, yeah, this New Year is going to be just filled with flowers. And a person answers this statement with saying, oh, how do you know that? And uh, the person said, because I planted flower seeds. <laughs> so I don't know why that strikes my fancy, but let's plant flower seeds and let's reap our flowers in every which way this new year. So thank you. Happy New Year.